Hello everybody, good afternoon and welcome to That's Football for your afternoon on a Sunday watch along which is West Ham against Chelsea. It's a London derby, it's time for Chelsea to deliver, it's time to see what West Ham are all about. Goal for West Ham! I'm forever blowing bubbles! It's a goal for West Ham! It's Agard on the back post and it's that guy, Ward Prowse. He's got a wand of a foot, James Wand Prowse has whipped a cross in on his home debut for West Ham. In fact, scrub that. I think it's his debut altogether. He whips a cross in from a corner and it's Agard. Agard, do, 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 because he has scored. Look at that. Back post, poor defending Conor Gallagher. What's Conor Gallagher doing there? I don't know what he's trying to do. Somebody said it, it's not Conor Gallagher, it's Rennie, it, it's uh, Alicia Russo. I have never heard him uh, set, uh, described as that before. Um, but um, I suppose there is, well, I don't think he looks anything like her. But the reality is, it's uh, James Ward-Prowse with a corner and it's West Ham 1-0 up already. And, well, I probably gave uh, Chelsea a little bit of a, a jinx there because I said defensively I expect them to be very good this season. But um, unfortunately, unfortunately for Conor Gallagher, he's not defended that back post very, very well. And straight away, Joseph, I'll give you the shout out because I think we're all thinking it. Might need to put Ward Prowse in my FPL this year. Very, very good goal. 1-0 to West Ham. Great start. But uh, Chelsea are in now. And Aniola, that's surely a penalty. He's got to give it. He's going to give it. Oh, it's offside. Oh, God. This game's exciting. It's exciting. Um, linesman put his flag up. Fair play. I think Jackson was looking for a... Yeah, he is. He's offside. You can see... It might be a little bit tight. Would it have been a penalty? I think it would, you know. Yeah, it would have been a penalty. But it's checking for a possible penalty and an offside. He looks offside to me. Oh, what a goal that is. What a goal that is. Chukawamiki. What a goal. He's arrived and that is an absolute banger for Chelsea. Well, that's that's put a cat amongst the pigeons for sure. Really got really good goal that for Chelsea, and he'll be buzzing, absolutely buzzing. This is the guy I think they bought in from Villa. I'm pretty sure, and uh, I'd love to say that Chilwell will get an assist, but I don't think he will because it's so so much more. Yeah, it won't be an assist from Chilwell, but he picks it up here. Oh, it's brilliant. Brilliant feet. Brilliant feet. Sends Sushek back on his holiday and then whips it. Oh, it's a great goal. It's a it's a great goal. Great goal. You can't you can't uh uh you can't uh, argue with that. Chukwumika, I think his name is. Chukwumika. I I don't know how you pronounce it, but uh, first senior goal. I believe they brought him in from Aston Villa for good money. And uh, Chuck Wu Mika is how you do it. It says BKG. And I tell you what, Chelsea needed that goal. They didn't want to be heading towards uh, half time, 1 0 down to West Ham. And they've equalised. Fair play. Um, some, obviously, I knew about Hoyland a, a long time before. Um, he's given a penalty here. It's a, is it a penalty to Chelsea? Yes, he's given a penalty. Sterling's won it. Penalty to Chelsea. Well, he's been getting a lot of stick. It's outside the box. That's outside the box. 100% outside the box. That's not a penalty. The tackle takes place outside the box. Won't be a penalty. VAR is going to take a look at this. Let's have a look. Looks to me like it's outside the box. No, he's given, well, he's given a penalty. 
given a penalty. And, and, and to me, it was very inconclusive. Very inconclusive, that. It continues inside the box. No, it's where the first contact of the foul hits. So if it's on the line, it's a penalty. But uh, very inconclusive VAR there. He's missed it. He's bloody missed it. Ariola. Some, some people say he's a bit of a tit. Well, he's very good at saving goalkeepers. Uh, saving penalties. Ariola with the save. Well, whether it was a penalty or not, he's redundant now. Uh, VAR was very quick to say it was in the box. I'm not convinced anyway. But what a save by Ariola. And, uh, well, I don't know. I don't know. Was he off his line a little bit quick, Ariola there? They might want to take a look at that. But you get every angle, slowed down. You are in, you are, you're informed. As the consumer, you are respected and you are informed. Uh, lovely run by Sterling. He's having a great game. This should be a goal. Chilwell blocked. I'll tell you what, Sterling's having a good game. I meant paid like corrupt, fixed, blatant missus's chip. I don't know about that. Um... Well, he's in one-on-one. -on -one. He's, uh, he's messed that up. Oh, he's messed that up. Was he onside, Ben Rama? Yes, he was offside. He was through one on one there. Yeah, he's 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 offside. He's off, he's offside. Okay, sorry, I was just being a bit rude there. Nice ball into Antonio. He's got the strength. He's all on his own. Don't shoot. Oh! <laughs> What a goal! What a goal! What an absolute bullet! It's like Mario Kart when you're in 12th place and you get the bullet and it takes you straight through to number one. What an absolute hit! Absolutely fantastic! Antonio! 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 What an absolute goal! That's getting clipped. Uh, don't shoot! And it's Disarcy! Disarcy, I'm telling you, I'm not having it! That is a bullet, an absolute bullet from, uh, call him Magnum, because that was a bullet. Absolutely brilliant. Look at this. This RC needs to get closer. Oh, what a goal. What a goal. That's, that's incredible. Absolutely incredible. We're right behind it here. Why does the RC stand off him? I think he's a bit suspect. I really said this. What did I say to you at the start of the first half? And how many good strikers shoot between the, the defender's legs? We are talking about this yesterday. How many of those strikers do that? Oh, somebody somebody says it could be offside. No, it's been given. Thank God, that would have been a, a crime on, to football. But um, yeah, if you are a budding striker down your local fibre side, have a look at that. Haaland does it all the time. How many good strikers... So, uh, oh, that's late. Agard, he's off. He's off. Second yellow. Well, the game's just changed there. I don't think he can argue. I don't think he can argue. What is he doing? Antonio's sort of saying to him, "What, what, what, what are you doing?" I don't think there's any argument. I thought it was a yellow card. Oh, he's got no argument there. You could almost argue it's a red. Nah, he's got no arguments with that. Absolutely none. No argument at all. He can't he can't complain with that. It's stupid. No complaints. There can be no complaints. Fan. He's given a penalty. £116 million to give a penalty away. Casido. £116 million, And that's what he's cost. That penalty cost Chelsea. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It, it just doesn't get any worse for Chelsea, does it? He's had an absolute stinker. That he nearly gave a goal away. It's, oh, it's a stonewall penalty. I mean, that ain't, you know, no one's complaining about that. The, the, the officiating in this game's actually been quite good. 
the red card. Remember, Chelsea, remember, just, just to remind you as well, West Ham are down to 10 men. They've been down to 10 men for 20 minutes. He conceded a penalty, says uh, Gorist Fump. Yeah, well, look, it's over. Chelsea, humi humiliation. Humiliation here. Can they complete the damage? Paqueta. He might miss it on purpose. He doesn't. He scores. And it's 3-1. And it's game over. And Chelsea are beaten. Three, well, they're losing. They're going to lose. It will be three goals to West Ham. And the worst thing for Chelsea is... I didn't think there would be a result more humiliating than Man United losing to Spurs. But Chelsea have come along and said, hold my beer. Because... We're going to lose to 10 men West Ham and we're going to bring on our £116 million player who is going to play worse than Scott McTominay, drunk, and uh, try and get West Ham to score goals. Uh, Casido knew he was moving to London. I don't think anybody told him he was playing for Chelsea today because he's been doing his best to get West Ham goals and he certainly delivered. Most expensive penalty in Premier League history, that. £116 million.